The moment I stepped foot in here, it was just different. It was, I knew I belonged here. It was the energy, the vibrancy was just something I hadn't experienced. Um, the food, the flavors were just incredible to me. It was, it was just, a, it really opened my eyes to the world and I just thought, you know, this is it, I have to be here. With the menu, I think, as with all food, we kind of want to achieve perfection, but you never do as a chef. Nature is different every day. We always want to champion amazing produce, seasonality, producers. Some of the people that are in the UK are producing the most phenomenal things. I, I feel quite passionate about keeping it on the menu um, as much as possible and really using and supporting those people. And as time goes on, that's something I'm getting more and more involved with. I go to the actual farmers, meet the farmers, see how they produce it, see their passion and, and often I'm quite taken by that um, and, and the growers sort of growing things by their personalities and, and some of them could be quite wacky um, and they don't do it for the fame or, or for it, they do it for the, the love of doing it and that's something that, that I feel that yeah, I want to keep always using their produce to keep them where they are because they also keep the countryside beautiful. It's very much part of our culture, the way we are operating in the UK now. We need to help the economy to survive in rural areas also um, and keeping sort of everything sustainable and, and it's something that we're working much, much more with. I mean, we're very much involved with sort of seasonal produce. Right now we've got sort of an abundance of game um, which we're very lucky to have in the UK also. We have had one dish on the menu since we've opened here and it's actually Gordon's dish. It's a lobster ravioli with langoustines, salmon, um, and it's just beautiful produce, quite simply prepared, and it's just a classic, stunning dish. So that stayed on the menu um, for the last 15 years and uh, it's one of our most popular dishes and it, it will stay on the menu. It's just fantastic ingredients. Um, so we've got Scottish lobster, Scottish langoustines and Loch Jewett salmon um, and they are just sort of dressed with a few herbs. We use basil, uh, coriander, with a tiny little bit of coriander because it's quite a strong herb and some chervil with a little bit of lemon juice and seasoning. Um, then wrapped in pasta and the garnish for the dish we serve Ossietra caviar and sorrel velute. So it's quite a glamorous dish, it's just stunning produce and it's actually just really simply put together just to really showcase the actual ingredients. There are new restaurants opening in London uh, every day and many of them are extremely talented cooks and uh, great chefs but it is something, it's such a difficult industry and it's so fickle and um, you've got to be more than just a good chef to, to run your business and, and you've got to be cooking what your guests want. Times change, trends change um, and you've got to always move with that and uh, you know I always think it takes three years to really become established and, and after three years you might get established and, and then you know it really takes sort of five to start really becoming a great great restaurant because it is so much more than just being a cook and many can be great cooks but they might not be around in two or three years time. You're sport for choice in London, there's just so many amazing places to eat. The level of, of restaurants has just keeps going up, I mean it, it, it all different sort of levels from a brasserie level to a three Michelin star restaurant, the standard just keeps improving. We have incredible produce in the UK that we didn't have 10 years ago and it is evolving and you have to evolve with it, with modern times and keep moving to stay ahead, to keep at the level at the top, the three Michelin stars. So continuously evolving. We work incredibly well together and I think that the evolution that I've seen since I've taken over has, it, we've really grown together and we continue to grow, we continue to get better. People and each individual is becoming better all the time and, and that's something that I'm really proud of and it, it, it's something that takes years and years of doing. That's not something that just happens overnight.